How you doing, everyone? This is uh, this is Ryan Turner. He's my good buddy. Uh, glad, thanks for being here. Thanks yeah. for doing a good workout. Yeah, you know it, man. Every Sunday. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, so tell me your. Let's start with left hand first. Tell me your experience with the, uh, the IFA Worlds. Come yeah, on. IFA Worlds. The first big tournament with international talent I've been to. Uh, <clears throat> it's crazy. I mean, just being in that environment. Uh, Seeing everyone, you know, I've been a fan of the sport for so long that, you know, when seeing these people in person, it's like, oh, there's Jeff Day, Bob Brown's here. So it was a blast, you know. Um, uh, me and my girlfriend both went and competed, and we, we likened it to being back at college, where you, you, you walk down the lobby of the, of the hotel, and oh, you yeah. just you just get jumped by all these people, but like, oh, what's up? So yeah. environment was killer. Uh, we had a blast. Um, got to watch uh, Masters, Grandmasters on Thursday. Um, and then, uh, came our competition day, uh, pretty, pretty deep class. I think there were something like 20 people in the super heavies, uh, I think an hour in the same class. Um, and, uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was a new experience. So I've done a few local tournaments, New England championships, a few in New York, but, uh, they are strict as hell. Um, the pads were like, might as well have been blocks of iron they were so so hard that if your elbow came up a millimeter yeah you see it yeah yeah, yeah. you see it so yeah i thought it was good <clears throat> yeah no it was great i actually kind of like that style because you know what you're getting the, yeah. the problem with so many of the local tournaments is i don't know what the cadence of the refs where they go is yeah. how how much are they going to let you get away with things you know can yeah. i jump the go can you not and uh so I like when it's just a consistent, all the refs are training the exact same way, they're all saying ready to go the same way, they're all going to get your wrist in the same position. So actually, I actually do like the consistency yeah. of the strict rules. Um, and yeah, it was, uh, I went, on left I went one and two. Um, you remember who you faced? Your first match? It was my first match. Um, the, uh, the guy from Washington? That, that, that wasn't my, my good arm. I kind of blacked that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> yeah, we don't talk about the left hand day. Uh, who cares about left hand anyway? Oh, um, well, who, who's, you know, who, who do you remember uh, left hand? I remember... You against uh, uh, Kurt? Or Carl. Carl, I think. Yeah, yeah, I think one of my losses was to Carl Stanley. Um, what, did he top roll or did he press? He... I think he... Nope. It's going back to me. Um... It was that uh, he also competes in hearing impaired with Chris. Yes, yeah, that's, that's what I was talking about. Yep. Well, he, uh, he lives in Washington. Yes, I remember, Josh, yeah. Josh Heck. Um, yeah, I mean, he, uh, I faced him left hand. He was very strong. He was very um, strong. You, I think you won that, though. Yeah, I ended yeah. up taking his hand, I yep. his hand went to, and I got his thumb. Yeah. And then we worked from there. But, yeah, he's got a very strong arm. <clears throat> I feel like uh, just my style kind of neutralizes a lot of his, of his attack. Yeah. You know, he kind of rolls. Yep. At least for me, he did. You know, I can't remember yeah. what he did to you. He, uh, I think, I felt comfy. He got into like kind of a hook, but he just, he has horsepower. He just, what do you do? Just, just lay yeah, down. Yeah, I just was not ready for that. Because yeah. I, I hadn't seen this guy before. And, yeah. uh, it was all side, all back. Or just, it was, it was just down. drag. Yeah, it was, it was kind of like a drag. I mean, he's got a, he, he's not, he's got a short forearm, yeah. short, thick, you know what I mean? So if he gets any bite on you, that. Right. It's going to be a, you know, good time getting out Yeah, of I actually kind of hate going against people with shorter forearms because when they lat drag, they were forearm short, so you, they really pull you over their pad. And yeah. I was super extended, and then it was over. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so... Uh, who, yeah. Who, who got who off the ready to go? I think it was pretty even. I, I remember being like, I'm in this, and then he really just cranked it up to another gear. I just was not ready for that. Yeah. Um... So I would, I would love another shot now that I kind of know what to Well, I have his, uh, his Instagram. You can shoot him a little message. There we go. Tell him. Uh, super match. Josh, if you're listening, I want payback. Yep. You're a strong dude. Yeah, um, good, man. Yeah. And then uh, I got a win. I'm uh, not sure his name. And then I want to say it was Carl who, who was my second loss. Did he top roll? Did he press? He... The guy I won? It's Carl. Carl. Well, then, yeah, after we'll talk about that guy. Okay, yeah. Uh, I think I got pressed, if I recall. Yeah, okay. 
Yeah, a flop press or with his hands? No, I think he kept his kept his hands. I know Carl has a nasty flop press. Yeah, I think it was just a uh, just got hammered. Um, <clears throat> and then the win I got was against this gentleman. Um, kind of just your standard hook mass, and I'm just uh, the ball dude, right? His ball. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think uh, that guy. Uh, I remember I won an armrest him all day because yeah. he cut the line. Oh really? Uh, I, got, it, I want this guy. Yeah, it, it, you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, Nick doesn't let a grudge go. Uh, <laughs> if you cut him in line. Uh, yeah, he's got a list. Of, he's got a list of people who cut him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all the way back to middle school, this one bastard in, in the lunch line. That's right. Uh, hey, you got the last shot. <laughs> 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 uh, that's too funny. Oh, man. What about that? You, you, the win, would you top roll him? Uh, no, we're him? just in a hook, and I just... just Kind of added a little side pressure, and uh, he, he got a stop. I was about a couple inches above the pad, but I just held there. I could have sat there all day. I think he knew that, so he just let it up. he just let it up. He didn't want to uh, blow as low, so to speak, on, on fighting a losing battle. Yep. And uh, yeah, that was left hand. So a little little bit of culture shock with the the IFA strict rules, but yep. um, I'm glad I got that out of the way before right hand, because um, that went a lot better for me. Um, and uh, so what was your first match right hand? <clears throat> first match right hand was Carl Stanley again. Oh yeah. Yeah. What happened there? He actually went outside, which was surprising. Top roll? Yeah, yeah. He, and then what happened? I mean, it wasn't like a. Full, it was kind of like a chafy style of top roll. Just side just yeah, it was a full hand, just a lot. Not quite inside, not quite outside. Um, and so that sent me to the B bracket, <clears throat> where I then. Went against uh, Fabian, I believe his name was, and uh, was he from Florida? I think he's a Florida. Yeah, right. Yeah, Viking kind of guy. Um, I think that I think you're thinking of Ryan North. Okay. But uh, yeah, that was that was a really good match. Um, I would be off the off the jump, I got like probably to, I'd say maybe ten o'clock. And then he started fighting back, but then I threw my shoulder around and went to what is my bread and butter, which is a press. And uh, hammered him to the pad. And that was my first win right-handed. Yep. Then from there, I went to uh, Ryan North, who I think is... Okay, yeah, that's what I was thinking of. Yeah, that's, right. yeah he's, he's awesome in Florida, because he's friends with uh, Brad Grundy. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Was, you beat him too, right? Brad? No, 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 you beat uh, right. yeah. North? Yep, North. Um, top roll? Double top roll? Both top roll? Yeah, yeah. And then he, he tried to challenge it. So with the IFA, you can pay 50 bucks to uh, challenge a call if you think uh, the refs made the wrong call. So, uh, yeah, he challenged it, but they didn't overrule it. They counted it as a pin. He, he, he said they called it too early. Oh, yeah. But it's weird because you can't. They couldn't uh, bring up the tape. It's worth a shot. It's, they yeah, can't bring up the tape. No, so like, I'm it's not sure. Just gotta discuss it. They just talk. And that's and, tough. That's tough. Right? How are you gonna get yeah. a ref? You gotta take it, make the, make a mess up. Exactly. So, so close. That's tough. But to be fair, um, we had cell phone footage that we looked at. It was a pin. Um, but I don't blame him for for. Yeah, you gotta try. You gotta, you gotta do. You gotta do. Exactly. It's worlds, you know. <laughs> so uh, yeah, so that was win number two. Climbing up the B bracket, then I had uh, the I forgot who I had next. It wasn't it wasn't Robbie Burnett yet. Was it? Um, maybe it was Burnett. I had a match with Burnett. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, maybe, maybe it was, was like a pretty good, pretty good back and forth for a little bit, or no? You got no it Burnett. Way. I uh, Robbie Burnett is the monster from Texas. Um, he was number one in Texas up until his match with Dimitri Kachan, and uh, I guess he's number two in Texas now. Dimitri won 3-2, if I recall. So I knew this dude was a monster. Um, and we slipped, so I went outside at first, and uh, we slipped. And then uh, I got a kind of a trick up my sleeve with a flop press, which I throw in every once in a while, and so right off the go, I set up behind my arm, and I think he probably thought I was going outside again, because that's what we did outside the strap, but I just dove in, and just, it was right to the pad. I don't, I don't think he saw it coming, um, and if, if you let me get behind my arm, 
you know, yeah, all 260 pounds of me, it's just, it's a lot to handle. Yeah. So, yeah, I got, I got a win, and I was, that's probably the biggest win in my career right there against Robbie. Oh, that's good. That's yeah. Good. Um, so you ranked it all, or is there any ranking list he's on? Yeah, I mean, it depends where you look. Yeah, um, it depends on whose opinion. Exactly. <laughs> I just saw that there's arm fighter rankings, there's in the hook rankings. Yeah, I think but, uh, one, well, you show, I think you show one that showed me. Uh, yeah. Like, uh, one person I'm seventh or something. One person I'm yeah, like, uh, eighteen. Exactly. <laughs> so it depends on who you ask. It depends who you're talking to. Um, <laughs> Someone likes me more. Ex- yeah, yeah. Exactly. Like the guy that likes me. You know? Yeah, yeah. The politics <laughs> aren't wrestling. Um, yeah, but he's up there. He's definitely at the top twenty. Um, yep. So, yep. So now uh, I'm now in the semifinals uh, with Nick and Carl Stanley, and so I have now the match with Carl. Yep. Winner faces Nick for first, and that, that was, was probably one of the most back and forth uh, matches. Yeah, of the day. yep, that was wild, yeah. man. Um, right off the jump, hit, and surprisingly, I actually got pretty far in my head. Uh, Elbow foul. There was um, so the match went. I hit outside. He caught me a few inches above the pad. Started grabbing me back, so then I just supinated, committed into a kind of a defensive hook. Yeah. So he was he was really starting to crank up horsepower, and so I kind of dug in and just sat. Then we were kind of I was probably in this position here for a good 15, 20 seconds as we kind of exchanged hits. Yeah. And it was weird because I, I wasn't able to pull him back to center, but he wasn't gonna pin me. I could have sat there for another 20, 30 seconds. But I made a mistake in transitioning to a press. Would you hand touch? You hand touch? Uh, my shoulder crossed the center line, oh, which is oh, oh. I regret so much yeah, because I, yeah. I was wondering what that was. <clears throat> I thought maybe your hand touch. I, I thought it was going. I thought you had him. I know. I, I felt uh, great, and I was. I, I transitioned too early, so that's that's the fatal mistake. Um, I should have waited, gassed him out a little longer, and then been a little more careful with that transition. But I was too anxious to get the match over with, and so I kind of just threw my shoulder around right past the uh, the hand peg. Yeah, yeah. And so I got I got called for that. So it could be worse, you know. Yeah, yeah, and then uh, that's one foul. We restart, and Carl also has a, a nasty flop press. Yeah. So yeah, it's good. He did what I did to Robbie Burnett and threw that at me, which I was not prepared for. Um, well, I knew he had it. I was prepared in that sense, but after the match we just had, I wasn't even thinking about it. I figured we'd go back to that. But yeah, he just dove in without even a strap. That's what. That's what's yeah. Crazy. You got that weird, you know, uh, little fingertip clamp. Yeah, that, right. I, I I couldn't even get out of it. He really kind of just bites on your hand, and so he just dove in, got me real open. I held for like a second before I went. Um, and uh, that was it. So I got me third, and then. We went on to face you in the finals. Yep. Why don't you talk about that? That was yeah. That was a good. That was a good match. Um, the first match, from what I can remember, um, you know, we, we we were both fighting for the setup. Yeah. Um, I don't think he didn't seem too comfortable. Um, I mean, I wasn't comfortable either, but I think he was more uncomfortable than me. Mm-hmm. Um, ready to go. Uh, half a second goes by and. Uh, I think he fouls. I think his elbow comes off the front. That's right. We restart. I think this time, same thing happens. We're in the center. We're hitting the center. Yep. Um, I think I have a secondary hit, which originally what the refs think is he fouls the second time, which should be my, would have been my win. Right. I, remember that. I think he protested or are they... They they changed, we both fouled or they did something right. and we both fouled so we had another restart. Okay. Similar thing happened. Um, I hit him sideways, straight just straight sideways. Yes. Uh, he fouls. You know I win on fouls. Right. He protests. He ends up winning the protests on. I think I must I uh, same thing we both fouled. Yeah. Uh, at least that's what the ref said. Right. You know. Um, which is ch- uh, challenging. I don't, I don't think I fouled. You know, yeah. I was digging my elbow in. Like I, right. 
you know what I mean, like crazy. Right. Yeah, it's not, not I just good. think uh, Star Carl kind of. Uh, he did what he had to do. Like it worked for you. Know, it's, it's, worked yeah, out, I mean, if you're in the match. finals of IFA, like yeah, it's the same thing. You know, uh, but they couldn't see video. How they know? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's I mean, a, that's a strange. Both role. refs, they were like both refs. Yeah, yeah. You know, so I don't know what happened. You know, maybe they were a little intimidated. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Carl, Carl's a monster, but yeah, he does like, have trouble keeping his elbow down. He, he yeah, got, he caught a few fouls that tournament. Um, but yeah, yeah you guys, I remember you guys restarted though. Volumes yeah. of times, and it was that was a crazy finals. I know I watched that match in slow motion. Yeah, and there were before the last last match. Yeah, uh, there were I think there was two or three fouls before they called the the foul. Right. That, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I think they just wanted a uh, a good match. You know what I mean? They didn't want yeah to be like, I, foul, bam, foul, bam, foul. Right, right. Call me a conspiracy theorist, but I do think right. sometimes they would let a few things go yeah. to. Uh, Get some more entertainment. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. They're a new organization. Yeah. You know, they're, they're trying to compete with WAF, yeah. which is a tall order. But so they need they need some good matches. And they got them. Yeah, yeah you guys had uh, some really exciting matches. Yeah. Um, it was good, you know? Yeah, it's a good tournament. Yeah. So, yeah, you, you ended up taking it. Did you did you take any losses? Oh, uh, right left hand, hand, I came fourth. Right, left hand. Three, two, or something like that. Right, right hand, I, I didn't take any losses. I think so, yeah. yeah you yeah. had a great, great showing. I mean, I had a real, you know, it was a good day. The turn, I mean, my the amount of the events that happened were yeah. definitely, you know, they favored me. Every Anytime something happened, yeah. it was, you know, for my favor, you know what I mean? You mean in terms of like calls? Or not, no, not in terms of call, but like how the day turned out, right? Yeah. Anything that changed momentum, right. that something drastic, yeah. it helped me. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, uh, oh, there's that arm break. Yeah. That, um, that sucked. I hope he's doing all right. Yeah, and uh, I feel like that changed the momentum yeah. a little bit, you know? Um, yeah. I, I he feel had like one he, left, that guy. He, yeah, he came, um, yeah, he came at first left. Yeah. And I can't remember his name, but I follow him on Instagram. Alexander. Uh, yeah. 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 Name, yeah. He'll come back. He'll come back strong. He will. They yeah. usually do. Yeah. Usually, if you if you take recovery uh, seriously, you can come back even stronger. Yeah. He seems like he's already in the gym, so that's good. Oh, really? I, mean, right. I see pose, so he's, right. I don't know if he's lifting, but he's in there. Good. You know what I mean? So that's a good start. Yeah, I just hope he didn't break his spirit. You know? I don't. Th- I mean, maybe, but yeah. just the way he walked off of that broken arm. Yeah. I don't think his spirit's broken. Good. We should be good. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, he went down. Yeah. Before, which which stinks. I think uh, you guys would have been had a really exciting match. I think that yeah. He's I, strong. He's what's he go straight sideways? Yeah, I think he, he puts his leg up. He twists. Yeah, just sideways. Exactly. So I, I'd be interested to see how you two match up. He yeah. would just be just a banger. But I don't know how fast was he. He was slower than St- well. He only put one Stanley, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. Cause Stanley, Stanley was on that match was faster. Right. One match. Cause that's what happened. Stanley hit, got uh, caught, and then yeah. tried to pull it back, and that's when it went. And so Carl got the jump on him. Um, it's. I'm curious whether or not had the arm break not happened, would he have been able to pull Carl back? That's why. I, <clears throat> maybe. Maybe. <clears throat> Yeah, but yeah, because I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying to use Carl as a gauge for how strong he is. Yeah, me too. Um, you know, um, <sighs> yeah, that's hard. Did he yeah. press him? He pressed Carl. Yeah, or I no? I don't think so. I think he's kind of just, 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 just a little bit of side pressure, a little bit of wrist flexion, and then uh, Alex tried to kind of do like a rotating hip back, and maybe his shoulder came a little more than he wanted, and then yeah, um, yeah, hate hate to see it, but. There were, there were three arm breaks that tournament. I think there were more than that. Right? Really? I think there was three, three that three. day. Jesus Christ. So I don't know if you heard about it, but someone broke their arm at the after I heard about that, yeah. Uh, from what I heard, they were like, all right, let's put the table away. Right. And then they're like, all right, one more pull. One. <laughs> <laughs> it's always <laughs> famous last words, one more pull. Oh, man. Um, did you do any after pull? No, I didn't do like, any after pull. Yeah. Nah. Uh, Some people asked me, and I... Uh, I just I said I was gonna do it, but then uh, yeah. Friday I just I felt good during, but then as soon as it was over, I just yeah. I was fucking shot, was tired. Yeah, it's a, it's a long day. Yeah. These, the, these big wow. I was hungry. Yeah. You know. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta I gotta fuel up. I hear you, man. Yeah. Um, yeah, I hung around a little bit. Um, pulled with Daniel Price. Who's the strongest Nancy. one you pulled after pull? Chances there. Yeah, how'd you do against him? Um. 
Better than I probably other. Well, it's hard to say because I had just finished right hand tournament, yeah. so I'm obviously smoked, and I got him after he pulled like six people, so he was smoked. Um, but I mean, it's he lives up to the hype. He's a strong dude. He's got that that post and top roll. It's tough to deal with. Yeah. Um, you like any video of him or not? I mean, there are cameras everywhere. I'm sure oh, somewhere. Yeah. I don't have but it. I'd like to see it just out of curiosity. Yeah, yeah, me too. Um, because it's always different what you think happened, and then when you see the tape, like you think, oh, I hung out, I hung with them pretty, pretty well. But then you watch the tape, and you actually get your ass. <laughs> so I, I'd be curious how delusional I am, but I think I did all right. Um, but uh, yeah, you know, just to set a little challenge match up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, chance, let's go. <laughs> no, I don't think I'm ready for chance yet. Who knows? But. After a couple more YouTube videos. There we go. A little bit. That's right. All right. Chance, chance to the end game. Um, I, I would be curious because I know Chance mm -hmm. wants Jerry really bad. That would um, be an interesting match. Yeah. I mean, if you get... I mean, I think Jerry... If I think I think Jerry gets him, especially if there's money on the line, I think if Jerry wants it... Right. I think if Jerry's practicing, anybody will pin him. Anybody will let anybody pin him for yeah. some practicing. Yeah. So... Um, yeah. It's, that's one of those polarizing matchups. Some people are like, oh, I think Chance can do it. They, they watch that practice footage from down in Florida. But then other people are like, Chance has, doesn't know Chance. He's, like, None. He's crazy trying to call out Jerry. So I think, I think there's lanes, but I just think, yeah. I think the experience and then, I don't know. I think that's a big thing, but just... If Jerry wants it, I think he'll take it. Yeah, no, I think uh, I think game day Jerry is a lot different than practice Jerry. I mean, he practices right around here in Massachusetts, we're in Connecticut, um, and uh, I've, I've practiced with him a few times, um, but he, he does gas. He gasses quick. I mean, Jerry at the start of practice versus Jerry at the end of practice are definitely two different people, so I don't know what which one we got in that footage of the yeah. chance, but uh, according to Jerry, I think he was saying he was tired, chance was more fresh, so... Yeah, I, I, I gotta, I gotta go with Jerry on that one. Um, he's just such a monster. What would you say if you did a best of five? How would you? I, I, I would say. Don't take this the wrong way, Chance. I don't, think, <laughs> I don't think you're winning one. I think you're. What is it? What is it? Twenty two. You got such a bright future, but I just think that's biting off more than you can chew right now. Um, I'd love to be proven wrong. I'd love to see a good match, but uh, you, you, you gotta know you're the underdog if you're listening to that. Um, but, you know, if he wants it and Jerry's happy to oblige and there's money on the table, yeah. I'm, I'm all for it. I'd watch that. Yeah. You know, you know Chance wants to come up and, and train with uh, Tim. and. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I talked to him and he wants to come up. Tell him uh, we'll turn the heat on for him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, you Florida people can't handle the <laughs> cold of the north. <laughs> oh, man. Too good. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, all in all... Killer tournament. Uh, I totally support what IFA is trying to do. I mean, obviously, it's still an asset organization. Um, it's, it's growing, and I think they're doing everything right. Denise and Leonard are on a tight ship. So, um, yeah, to anyone listening, support it. You know, we 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 got to help these things grow. We got to help the sport grow. More competition, the better, in my opinion. Um, I wish I wish WAF and IFA could be on better terms and. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I think I think, what, I think we might be banned from I think so. I think technically <laughs> my buddy's like, all right, when you sign up for IFA, use a fake name so that you can then go oh, yeah. <laughs> Which, oh, It's just silly. It's that's, just, that's how you grow the sport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. That's not what we should be doing here. So, uh, uh, yeah. We'll learn, hopefully. Yeah. It'll cool. all work itself out. Yeah. Sweet. So that's... Yeah, anything else you uh, want to tell the people? Um... If you're in the Northeast, New England Championships, October 30th, um, hopefully this video will be up before then, come, it's in Natick Mass, uh, events are on Facebook, New England Championships, um, one, usually one of the bigger tournaments in the Northeast, so try to hit that up, and um, we'll see you there. Alright, I cool. appreciate it, man. Hey, thanks, Nick. Great chat with you. Good yeah, training. Time, you know? Yep, see you, too. I was trying to make sure this recorded the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. No, I definitely did. Yeah.